It's time for our DC thing. When a fence went up at the White House after the police killing of George Floyd back in 2020, protesters pressed themselves up against that chain link barrier and adorned it with hundreds of signs, also notes, banners and photos. It became yet another symbol of the Black Lives Matter movement. Those items were removed last year, but saved in storage thanks to people like Nadine Seiler. She's been organizing and handpicking the pieces of art to drive in batches to Baltimore, where art us there digitize them with a special scanner. Everything anybody came and put that was Black Lives Matter related or ally related, we kept. The digitized versions of these bits of history were sent to the D.C. Public Library where Siler and others have been writing descriptions for each item. And finally, after all this time, they're able to view every sign, every banner, all now available online. Hmm. Digdc.dclibrary.org. That's where the D.C. Library has just posted the entire archive. Siler says she hopes to eventually find a permanent home for the physical artifacts. But for now, the digital archive is definitely worth a look and there's the website there digdc.dclibrary.org it's history yeah you know it's like the writings on the berlin wall it's mm -hmm. uh, it should be memorialized so i'm so happy there are people who know how important it is i agree it's pretty awesome all right